trail with one. Here's race three. And there they go. Magnus with a great jump, Mayfield right behind. Yoshi battling to get past Carroll. Big wreck at the end, at the finish line. Looks like, yes, they both crossed the line, so they will both get points. Yoshi just ahead of Carroll to get that third spot, get the two points. Let's see the replay here. Johnson with a great run. Blocks Mayfield to keep that first spot. Coming in P1, Mayfield P2. And right there, Yoshi connects with Carroll. See it again. The stewards might have to take a look at that one. Here we go for race number three. And away they go. Mr. Shotgun Marco Polo side by side through that corner. Numbskull just in front, but at the line, too close to call. Wow, what a close finish. Thank goodness for the Boss Championship Racing. Instant replay, here it is. Marco Polo with a nice run. Mr. Shotgun, though, able to keep him side by side and to the line. Wow, too close to call. Let's see if we can zoom in a little more, slow it down. It looks like Mr. Shotgun by a nose, but just, here it is again. I don't know. I mean, I have to say as well, Numbskull had a nice lap to get that P3. Well, here's a super close up. It's gonna have to go to the judges. And there you have it. Mr. Shotgun will get the five points by just a nose. So Mr. Shotgun is gonna need a miracle. But for the entire grid, the race is on. So here we go, race number four. And they're off. Mr. Shotgun with a great start. Indy Rain right there. But here comes Tommy Yoshi on the inside, last corner. And across the line, too close to call. Here is the replay. Mr. Shotgun defending two drivers, essentially, and at the line. Wow, too close. Let's see that again. Just a huge effort from Tommy Yoshi into that last corner, and then just pedal to the floor, able to cross the line by just a nose in front of Indy Rain, and grabs that point. Waiting for the gate to drop, and they're off. Lucas Santos way out in front. Oh, big crash in the last corner. Sundegard. Upside down. Hope that the safety crew gets over there quickly. Here's a replay. Lucas Santos and Sundegard way out in front. Looks like Sundegard gets off track. Thankfully, no one hits him. Here it is again. Just ran out of room. Santos had the corner. Sundegard did not let off. Major finish in the front row next to Speedball Herman. Here they go. Major finish with a nice start. And contact into that corner. Scott coming out from fourth to second. What a pass. Wow, let's see that on the instant replay. Major finish with a nice start. And it looks like Speedball gets caught up behind Olivia May. There was some contact there, which led to Scott going from last to P2. That will swing the points quite a bit. Here it is again. Looks like Olivia May just gets really loose, and Speedball Herman had nowhere to go. And like much of the tournament, it comes down to this race, race number four. They go green. Marco Polo with a nice little lead. Scott right there. Big contact in that last corner at the line. Major finish, finishing in front of Arlo. That is huge. 
in this tournament. Here's the replay. Scott making a run on Marco Polo and Arlo making some contact, which ended up proving to be costly because major finish coming from fourth to third gives him 12 points and the win. Well, let's go track side for more with Hamish. All I can say, Nils, is wow, what a race. Yeah, that's no joke. What'd you think of that last second pass there at the end? Major finish has given us the performance of his life, leading RLO SOL. Out of luck is right. Who will be the 2023 Formula One champion at Boss Championship Racing? Lights out. Tomi Yoshi getting a good jump. Numskull in second, but here comes Scott with a pass into P2 and across the line. Tomi Yoshi will finish first but Scott will be the winner with that huge pass, as we can see here in the replay. Numskull did not have an answer for him, and Scott flew right by. And with that, will be the winner and the champion of the Formula One tournament. What a great pass there for Scott, and heartbreak there for Tomi Yoshi. So here we go for race number two, Misty moving up, Harlow moving over, waiting for the lights, and they're out, here we go. Harlow on the outside with the pass. Indy Rain as well, but Misty coming right back and takes the win. Wow, what a finish. Here is the replay. Harlow and Indy Rain get away, get a clean pass, but Misty never giving up, gets back to the top and takes P1. That might be one of the best passes we've ever seen at this track. Here it is again, both Arlo and Indy getting a clean pass. Looks like Arlo gets up on the curb, goes to the outside to block, but Misty goes inside, grabs the lead, and gets the win. Invincible.